Creating an environment that is a positive experience for both your employees and your customers is a win-win for your business. Up next, we'll review steps from Larry Sutton, R&R Tire Express CEO and founder and tire review contributor on building a positive work environment that you can use in your tire dealership. One way to create a positive work environment is by thinking of your business as a reverse hierarchy. That means you, the owner, is a low man on the totem pole and everyone else in your organization is above you. This creates a situation where managers talk amongst themselves and other employees to find the answer to a problem. A lot of times, answers come from the people doing the work, not necessarily the people in charge. It's also important to treat your employees as human beings rather than assets or investments, which means showing an interest in their lives outside of work. If an employee is going through a hardship, ask how you can help. This can foster a relationship built on trust, which is something good tire stores must have. To foster a good work environment, your store leader should be approachable. Leaders should be available to the store to answer any questions employees may have and should be visible in social environments. Work parties are one way to achieve that because they build camaraderie, and it's an opportunity for you to offer employees a good time, both of which create a positive work environment. The last simple step to creating a positive work environment is treating everyone with respect. Oftentimes, when employees treat others, colleagues, and customers how they want to be treated, it creates a positive energy in the workplace. Being polite and respectful to others is the foundation for effective leadership methods. I'm Danielle Hess, coming to you from the Tire Review Continental Tire Garage Studio at Babcox Media. Thanks for watching.